Welcome to my channel. I've been asked to, re to react to J. Cole's singing Love Yours. The only thing I know about J. Cole is what I looked up on Wikipedia yesterday. So this will be a new experience for me again. And I thank you for suggesting him. But before we get to that, I have to thank you for coming to my channel. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for commenting and thank you most of all for for just blowing up my channel. The, the growth in my channel is amazing to me. It's, it's stunning. And as always, I will put in the description all the links that I can find to J. Cole's channel. And I ask that you click on the more on the description underneath the video so that you can find those links and you can subscribe to his YouTube channel and to any of his social media accounts that you want to and you can buy his music on Spotify if you're interested so thank you for that this is J. Cole titled Love Yours Parental advisory. Huh. Love yours. Love yours. No such thing. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing. No such thing. Heart beating fast, let a nigga know that he alive Fake niggas, mad snakes, snakes in the grass Let a nigga know that he arrive Don't be sleeping on your level Cause it's beauty in the struggle, nigga It's beauty in the struggle, nigga Okay Uh I'm not going to stop the video because I understand that this is normal for black performers, but personally, I find the use of that term offensive. Uh, it just, I don't understand why when this was a pejorative that was used to denigrate black people that the youngsters use it as a, a an adjective and a noun and and use it constantly i was on on the dark train coming back from downtown i probably went to jury duty or something and there was an elderly black gentleman sitting a couple rows in front of me i judged him to be maybe about 10 years older than me and Along the way, we made a stop, and four young black men got on the train and sat across from me, directly across from me, two rows behind this elderly man. And they were, they were talking, and every other word was that word. And it just made me cringe because I thought to myself, that old man and his generation fought to get to put a stop to the use of that word and now you're using it like it's water I don't understand it I really don't but I know it's part of the culture and so I just have to suppress my feelings of disgust and just listen to what they're singing yeah. It's beauty in the struggle, ugliness in the success. Hear my words and listen to my signal of distress. I grew up in the city and know sometimes we had less. Compared to some of my niggas down the block, man, we were blessed. And life can't be no fairy tale, no once upon a time. But I'd be goddamn if a nigga don't be trying. So tell me, mama, please, why you be drinking all the time? Does all the pain he brought you still linger in your mind? Cause pain still lingers on mine. On the road to riches, listen, this is what you find The good news is, nigga, you came a long way 
The bad news is, nigga, you went the wrong way. Think being no broke was better. A life that's better than yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Think being no broke was better. A life that's better than yours. No yeah, being such broke thing. Was no such yeah. thing. For what's money without happiness? Or hard times without the people you love? Yeah. Though I'm not sure what's about to happen next. I asked for strength from the Lord up above Cause I've been strong so far But I can feel my grip loosening Quick, do something before you lose it for good Get it back and use it for good And touch the people how you did like before I'm tired of living with demons Cause they always inviting mo. Think being broke was better Now I don't mean that phrase with no disrespect To all my niggas out there living in debt Cash and minimal checks Turn on the TV, see a nigga Rolex And fantasize about a life with no stress I mean this shit sincerely And as a nigga who was once in your shoes Living with nothing to lose I hope one day you hear me Always gonna be a bigger house somewhere But nigga, feel me Long as the people in that motherfucker love you dearly Always gonna be a whip that's better than the one you got Always gonna be some clothes that's fresher than the ones you rock Always gonna be a bitch that's better out there on the tours But you ain't never gonna be happy till you love yours no such thing as a life that's better than yours Love yours no such thing as a life that's better than yours Love yours no such thing as a life that's better than yours I love yours No such thing, no such thing Heart beating fast, let a nigga know that he alive Fake niggas, mad snakes, snakes in the grass Let a nigga know that he arrived Okay, I like the way he does it. Alive, arrive. That's kind of cool. I like the message. I don't like all the cussing. And the use of that word, that just disgusting word. But I know that's how the black rappers do it. And that's one of the reasons why I've never watched black rap. Because I just it just turns me off. It, it's... I'm from an older generation, a generation that fought for rights and equality, and that word is, it's a trigger, it's a trigger for me, it gets me upset, so I like his message, I think his message is a good message, I just wish it was couched in better words. Hmm. Hendrix. Okay. So that's J. Cole. Love yours. Like I said, good message, really good message. I hope uh, I hope that young black men who are in troubled situations listen to what he says and understand the message that he's bringing them because it can lift them out of the, the negativity that they live in. Uh, I, I, I might listen to some more of his stuff. I, I don't know. It's really hard for me to let, hear that word. It really is. It just, it's like sandpaper rubbing against me. Just me. So thank you for suggesting it. And just know that I pray for you, that you will have an abundant life, that you'll be healthy and you'll live a long time, and that God will keep you safe from harm. I pray he'll do the same for every person that you love. And I pray most of all that you will be anxious for nothing, but in all things, through prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, you will make your requests known to God. And the peace that passes all understanding will keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. This is the Vietnam era vet out. <laughs>